नमस्कार आदाब सत श्रीकाल टेक्स सीरीज हैंड्स ऑन लर्निंग इज बैक दिस इज आई बी व्हाट्सअप गाइज दिस टाइम न्यू कोर्स न्यू सब्जेक्ट दैट इज एवरीबडी सर्चिंग डेस्परेटली ऑन इंटरनेट इज जावा एंड आई एम गोना रूल दिस वन विथ टेक्स सीरीज स्टाइल द वेरी फर्स्ट टॉपिक ऑफ जावा सीरीज इज वॉट इज सॉफ्टवेयर सो लेट स्टार्ट विथ स्मॉलेस्ट यूनिट ऑफ इट इंस्ट्रक्शन Instruction is nothing guys it is a command it tells a computer what to do if we have collection of instructions for computer is called program guys if we have created more than one programs and club them together it becomes software means software is a collection of program then how many types of software there are two types of software application software and system software let's start with application software it is created based on particular requirement of users application software is used by mostly organization to manage its employee data for its details etc these are examples of application software word processors ms word is a one of the word processor a spreadsheet MS Excel is one of the spreadsheet presentation software MS PowerPoint is a presentation software CAD CAM software AutoCAD ETC is a CAD CAM software used for 2D 3D design mostly used by mechanical or civil engineers guys application software is further categorized into three sections desktop application or stand alone application second web application and third mobile application desktop application is further categorized into two section cui application command user interface application gui graphical user interface application let's start with desktop or stand alone application these kind of application do runs with within a underlying operating system environment in a layman terms those application which runs on double click on computer is called desktop or a stand alone application browser such as mozilla chrome safari etc vlc ms word ms excel are example of desktop application desktop application can be created using java programming language desktop app is categorized into two section cui and gui now let's start with cui command user interface application it is totally based on commands for input or output keyboard mostly used in cui application let's start with a gui graphical user interface application contains graphics like text fields buttons combo boxes we can use mouse and keyboard both in this application now let's move to another section of application software web application it runs within a small piece of software that is browser web application resides on server it is accessed by url it can be made using html css javascript jquery java programming language it is the combination of so many things now mobile application are those application which runs on a mobile operating system like android ios symbian bada etc the famous mobile applications are whatsapp uc browser etc now let's move to another section of software that is system software system softwares are basically used to make hardware usable operating system like window linux mac and device drivers for motherboard printer are system software system softwares are mostly written in c language suppose there is an event at your home you have decorated your home using decoration bulbs that runs on a pattern 
If you observe decoration bulbs, it contains a chip. Chip is a hardware. And you will be surprised to know that system software is installed on a chip that make it usable, that make decoration bulbs enable to run on pattern. Means system software make hardware usable, such as ATM gates, LED bulbs, ATC is made usable by system software which is created in embedded system with the help of C programming language. Next important question will occur in our mind, how do we create software? So software programmer can write instruction with the help of any programming language. Once the program has been completed, it is compiled into a language that the computer can understand. Some programming languages are C, C++, Java, .NET, PHP, Python, etc. Next question is how do we get software? So software can be purchased or downloaded from internet. It can be purchased in Blu-ray, CD, DVD and or you can download it, download it from internet. Shareware is created for sell after a trial period. Lightware software, it is just like shareware but some less capabilities. Freeware or public domain software, it is completely free but you have to follow copyright restriction law. Open source software, it is a free distribution with a source code for improvement of technology and or products like Java, Linux, etc are open source software. So I hope you guys got something out of this. If you like what you saw, please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, let's talk, have a chat and figure out better interest other than we will make code stuff in next future video and of course if you want to give suggestions you're welcome i'll catch you guys later have a nice day from tech series hands-on learning thank you for watching this video bye for now